News at 5 starts now. Good evening, everybody. I'm Rick Aaron in for Glenn Mills tonight. And I'm Emily Flores. We thank you for joining us here this evening. Now, a new study showing Americans are leaving large cities and moving to more rural communities. And research suggests working from home could be a reason for the change. As more and more companies realize their jobs can be done from remote locations, ABC 4's Haley Hendricks live in Wasatch County with that story this evening. Hey, Haley. Hey, Emily, the pandemic has given more than half of employed Americans the opportunity to work from home, and some want to continue that routine, but not live in the city. So they're moving to places like Heber. Built homes and new developments are selling quickly as people flock to the state. Lisa Orm grew up in Wasatch County. Her family, some of the earliest settlers here. The Swiss settled here because it reminded them of home. Throughout her life, she's seen her community grow. Unfortunately, from somebody who grew up here my whole life, and I love the small town. I love that feel. Um, and it's very sad in a lot of ways. On the flip side, as a realtor, um, you know, business is really good. It's booming. Heber City now ranking fifth in the nation for population growth in the last year. New York Times data suggesting many people are on the move as working from home offers a new way of living. I have uh, clients from Kansas City and they work remotely. They want it out of Kansas City. Since the pandemic hit, Orm says the demand for housing has increased. We listed a home last weekend and we had 13 offers in 24 hours. On average, home sale prices in Wasatch County increased almost $124,000 in the last year. That's according to the Utah Association of Realtors. Affordable housing is a huge crisis right now. Um, and that's what's happening because of the huge growth. Because of how fast it's growing here, infrastructure remains a top issue as the county and cities try to keep up with the demand. Post pandemic, Orm believes the housing market here will continue to boom as more businesses offer flexible workplaces. Reporting live in Heber, Haley Hendricks, ABC4 News. Thank you very much, Haley. So far,